there are plenty of options available when it comes to investment you can choose any of them according to your financial goals but nowadays there is uncertainty in the market so the focus of investors basically shifts to fixed income and guaranteed returns people choose fd as small saving investments so hello welcome to business today i am sakshi and today i'll tell you about national saving certificate scheme that is nsc so in this video we'll talk about what is nsc how to take nsc investment and interest rate types of certificates and benefits of the scheme so what is nsc the national saving certificate scheme nsc is a fixed income investment that you can open in any post office branch of the country it is basically the government of india initiated it is a saving bond that encourages subscribers mainly small to mid income investors to invest in it let's now talk about the key information of nsc scheme the interest rate of nsc is 6.8% per annum which is basically more than fd in this scheme the account can be opened with a minimum investment of rupees 1000 for your information there is no limit on maximum investment the maturity period of nsc is 5 years also the risk is very low in nsc and one can get a tax benefit up to rupees 1.5 lakh under section 80c how to take nsc a single holder type certificate can be purchased by any person under his name or his child name certificates of 1000 5000 10000 or any number can be purchased there is no limit to investment in nsc you can choose any investment number according to your capacity now let's talk about the type of certificates in nsc there are three type of certificates in nsc first single type second joint a type and third joint b type so let's talk about the single type certificate the single type certificate can be purchased by any person under his name or under his child name joint a type in this type of certificate there has to be a joint account that is two people in joint b type two people have to invest in this but only one of them can withdraw it during the time of maturity now let's talk about the benefits of the scheme Investing in NSC provides tax exemption under 80C of the Income Tax Act. However, this exemption is available only investment up to rupees 1.5 lakh. NSC is accepted by all banks and NBFCs as collateral or security for loans. An investor can nominate any member of his family. Issue eight of NSC can be transferred to any person. However, this can be done only once before its maturity. On transfer of the certificate the name of the new holder is written after cutting off the name of the old holder on the old certificate and its purchase application The government has 100% guarantee on your money deposited in the post office that is your money is also completely safe If you like the video do like comment share and subscribe